Hey everyone. So I'm just in my bathroom getting ready to go out. My hair is going to get totally frizzed out when I get outside because I ran out of, well, it's hot and it's humid. That's really the whole thing. And I don't have any more hairspray either to help me. And I don't feel like flat ironing my hair. So yeah, I'm just getting ready because I'm actually going to take you with me on a vlog day and I mean I just have a little running around and I thought I would take this time to just catch up with you and just tell you what's been going on in my world and yeah so we started my bathroom and I will be going out I'm just finishing getting ready and um yeah I'm gonna be doing some you know I used to do these kind of vlogs right back in the day, um, just like daily life stuff. And I feel like I wanna do that some more. So hopefully I continue to do it. So uh, yeah, I'm sure you wanted to watch me put on my uh, lip gloss. How does it look? Wonderful, huh? So yeah, um, that's what I'm gonna do. So, want to go? Want to play? Want to see what's up with me? I have some things that I need to get. I wasn't planning to go out and do things, but my mom sent me this mess. So, like a good little daughter should, I'm going to go to the store for my mom, even though I just took her to the store yesterday, and then I went to the store myself, and now I have to go deal with the store. And... I don't like going to the store these days. I do not like going food shopping because of the obvious. So, but, you know, that's what happens. So, yeah, let's go. Because I'll tell you why I don't like going to the store. And I'll tell you, I don't know. I'm going to just tell you what's on my mind today. What's on my heart. No, I don't know if what's on my heart, but definitely what's on my mind. So, um, anyway stick around and if you're not subscribed please do look this is my vision board that I made for this year so I just keep it set up right here so I see it every day from my bed and also as I come in and out of my room as it falls on the floor all the time and the the picture next to it is Yosemite and that totally has such a meaning to me so I have that there so yeah, let's see what's in store for today. I hope that you will like it. There's my office. A little messy, but that's where I create. That's where I do my thing, my living room. Yeah. So let's go outside.
Yep, I need to put on one of these. And my mom made me like a really frilly, frilly thing. And I have some uh, bandanas that I actually prefer to wear. And then I got this from one of my friends on Facebook. So I'll wear this one today. So here's the list for Mommy Dearest. Yep, this is what we'll be doing. But I'm also going to other places. So don't worry, it's not going to be that boring. So, how do you like my look? Ugh, it bugs me. I don't like it at all. So, uh, hopefully you can hear me as I'm being muffled. You know, that is part of the mask thing, to muffle yourself. I say muzzle yourself. Yep. Yep, that too. So, I'm just going to run into this store real quick and pick up these items can't breathe and wearing these masks it's like you don't want to breathe. I mean, not breathe. I do want to breathe. I can't breathe. breathe. What kind of broth does she want? She wants mushroom soup, but she didn't tell me cream or golden. Mother, you didn't tell me which one you want. I don't know which one she wants. I have no idea what she's making. And I don't even like Campbell's soup. But I guess that's what she wants. I guess I'll get one of each. I, don't, I actually don't see golden mushroom. Oh, there it is. I have no idea what she wants. And the froth. Um, yeah, it, the mask makes you not feel like talking. I don't want to talk to anybody in the store because it's it's for obvious reasons and I think that's a control issue to be honest beef broth which one something organic beef flavor why is it flavor shouldn't it just be beef that's weird never spent so much time picking out uh, broth my earring is stuck in my in my stupid mask. All right. Um, here we go. Okay. That's it. Oh, we got to go one way. So it takes twice as long because you got to follow the, the aisle rules. All right. I'm out of here. I decided to make a detour to the chocolate section. Yeah, this is my choice. All right, let's go. It's, it's very magical. Uh, no, in the same bag is good. So if it's magical, what does it do for you? Well, it doesn't have sugar. It's got a lot of calories. Well, you don't eat the whole thing. I would. Well, you do eventually. I will eventually, but that will probably be three or four different tries. Yeah, that's not bad. Thank you. When I get a hold of the chocolate bar, I have to put it up on the top of the cover after I open it. Well, when you eat that dark chocolate, you, it's hard to eat all that at once. It's very rich. Oh, yeah. $6.49, 10 or 10 more. Awesome. Thank you, darling. Thank Have you so night. much. You too. Don't you love it when you're in a store and the checker or the person, cashier, whatever you call them, and the person bagging or the person bagging will make comments on the food you buy. I always find that very interesting. 
my mask must have um, shrunk because it keeps trying to come off my ear. It doesn't want to work either. It doesn't want to be a mask. It never asked to be a mask. In fact, I think the woman who made this told me she made it out of a sheet. It wanted to be a sheet. It wanted to, to get uh, be part of the action of being a sheet. But instead, it has to be a muzzle. That's sad. Who would want to be a muzzle? Not me. Okay, first stop down. Next stop. Next stop. Uh, Walgreens. Toilet paper run. My mom is obsessed with toilet paper. She has to have a whole supply because she goes through a lot of it. So we got to make sure she has that handy. So let's Stop toilet paper and um, I come here usually on a Wednesday or a Thursday and it's Tuesday so there may not be toilet paper usually they have it on Wednesdays or Thursdays well we'll see what happens success so she was just asking me how I was and I told you I don't like to talk why am I wearing this I could take it off I told you I don't like to talk when I'm wearing this thing. So I'm very short in the store and then people ask me how I am because I think I'm being short. Um, and I'm not talking about my height. And um, I told her I hate these masks. And she said, I hate it too. She said, sometimes I just feel so dizzy. I said, oh yeah, I can't breathe either. I feel sorry for people who have to wear that shit all day. All right, on to better things. Now I get to go shopping for me. I'm gonna go to Tuesday mornings and I think that stores Marshalls over there. Let me go do this.
like those days were a long time ago, but it was actually just a year ago that I moved. when it's super hot. I mean, that's not true. I, I like to go, but yeah, I don't want to burn my precious, beautiful skin, but I'd definitely be in that water, although the water doesn't look that smooth like it typically does, but it looks pretty. I'm sure it's nice out there. I'm sure the water's warm, and yeah, I think it's awesome. So hopefully my mask doesn't fall off in there because it keeps coming off of my ears and getting tangled up in my earrings. It looks like I have troll ears because it keeps pulling. Oh, why did this thing have to have to uh, shrink? What's up with that? I mean. COVID, COVID life issues, right here, right here. So let's head out. So yeah, I'm doing some really important shopping today. I'm looking for a bird bath because I want to put water in the back for my lizards and my birds and squirrels. And I'm looking for some kind of hairspray and uh, shampoo. So, very important shopping, very essential shopping going on here today. Let's see what I can find. Tuesday morning. It says open, but it looks closed. Oh man, what does this say? Oh, they closed early. That's ridiculous. I guess I'm not going to go there today. It's closed. It's closed. So, I think I might go to Big Lots then to check for a bird bath because that's really what I want most. Um, but let's go to Marshall's. I want to check out the hair products. They might have it, but I doubt it. So that's weird. She just shut the door on my face. They closed. I guess I'm not getting that either. What is up with that? Went all the way out here to do my thing and nobody wants me to go to their store today. So I'm gonna go check to see if Big Lots is open. I will check it online instead of driving there because I drove all the way out of my way to come here for zero. I'm trying to think of, so let's see what they got here. I also remember I need to get a small pot to repot my mom's plant. So I will see if they have something like that too. So let's go. Let's see what's up. What's up? Herbs. I want to plant some herbs. I don't know when you're supposed to be planting herbs though. Maybe I should. Wash your hands frequently and cough into your elbow. We are committed to your safety while maintaining our sewer. We continue to resupply our sewer daily with priority. 
Okay, that's totally creepy. That creepy machine over there is telling us what to do. It's really creepy. Muy importante. Gracias. They have lots of cool, beautiful things here. Let me see what I can find. Okay, lots of Oh, succulents. That would be fun. Maybe I should put together a succulent garden. Yeah? I think I can dig it. Cacti. Oh, those are so cute. I love them. These are nice. Wasn't they ever grow those? All right, stay on, stay on your focus, Cynthia. We're looking for bird bath. This is their bird bath. A mushroom troll. Looks kind of cute, cutish, I guess. And. Whatever these little fountain ones, that would be nice. I actually would prefer a fountain one, but I don't know that I want to pay that price. The bird up there, speaking of birds. Hmm, what should she do? What should she do? Other places for bird baths because the ones they had I didn't like. So I'm just looking for a nice pot. That one's nice. In the meantime, but I don't think I will buy that here either. I think I could get a better deal somewhere else. Yeah. So I'm gonna go to another store now. I'm on my hunt. I'll check one more store, then I'm heading home. So I didn't end up with a bird bath, but I ended up with one of these that I'm gonna put on my deck. Now I think I'm gonna check one other place for a bird bath, and if I don't find it, then I will look at Amazon. Not last stop. Yep, I had to come, it's close by. I thought they were closed, but it appears to be open. I'll check this real quick and get the heck out of here as soon as I can. Flowers aren't blooming. I still like the colors of the leaves. One of these. I think they're the same flower, just a different color. These four flowers, plants, are begging to be taken. They don't want to live here anymore. They were begging and I listened. All right, I'm out of here. Couldn't save any more than that tonight. They're all smashed in here. I think my duck is gonna look so pretty. My retail therapy is finished. And my plants are really happy to be here. Now I'm gonna move so the motion light goes on. And this the, a lot of these plants really wanted to come home with me. This one needs a little help, but he'll be pretty. White and pink. Um, 
you know, I have them on this rail and I know that those are going to have to move because when it gets windy, it, these will fall. I am sure of it. So this is one of those citronella plants for mosquitoes and it smells so good. Very fragrant. And this little guy, he was only $1.17. Super pretty. And that's the one I showed you. And I wanted to actually hang that one up here. There was a hanger and that when I went to hang it, the hanger just broke in half. So yeah, I wanted to hang actually two of these plants. This one is super pretty. I don't know why it has a flag in it, but whatever. It's just a really pretty collection. And then this one I wanted to hang too, but there was only one hanger and the hanger died. So yeah, they look really pretty along there. I'd like to get more, but I know I'm gonna probably have to take them off of there, unfortunately, unless I can figure out a way to strap them down. But then when, you know, hurricane season comes and stuff, I mean, there's gonna be tons I need to take these plants off of here because of the, uh, sometime we have extreme weather. So I don't know, they'll probably end up like that. <laughs> but at least I'm beautifying my area and I'm gonna really beautify it a lot. I'm gonna get a fern. I want to get a wind chime out here because I spent a lot of time out here so why should it look barren? It shouldn't look barren. I haven't wanted plants at all for years. Like I used to be a plant person, used to do all that because, you know, moving to Egypt and moving back here and moving quite a bit, I just never cared. But I don't know why all of a sudden I just feel like dressing up my back deck and i think already it's feeling great and this and uh two of the lizards came out to check out the plants already so i'm sure they're going to be excited to have some greenery and stuff to play in so it is night time as you can see want to go for a graveyard walk the graveyard is right there. Shall we go walk the graveyard? No, I'm not going to go there alone. I would, but I prefer not to go there alone. That is not a house. That is our garage. FYI. Looks like a little apartment, but it's not. Anyway, let's see. What else can I tell you? So I am sure I wanted to tell you something useful today. Normally I don't come on my channel without something useful to say, but I pretty much think that this today's uh, segment was just a vlog of what Cindy did today. So I know it could have been more exciting, but my plans just didn't go as planned. But that's what I did today, and I will see you soon, very soon. Take care, you all. Have a great night.